Hey everyone, this is Valentin from musicgreatness.com and in today's lesson, we are going to learn Unwritten by Natasha Bedingfield. And it sounds just like this. Alright, so in this first part, we are going to learn the introduction, the verse, and the pre-chorus. So the introduction is quite simple, but there is a little trick with the rhythm. Our right hand will play this simple melody. And we will repeat it. So it goes A, B flat, A, A, G, G, F. By the way, we are in the key of F major, so we have a B flat. So we go A, B, A, A, G, G, F. Let's add the counts. It goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, together, 1, 2, 3, 4, very nice. So that's all for the right hand. The left hand will play an F with the thumb on every offbeat, like this. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And that's all. Please be sure to master hands separated, because when you will combine the hands, it will get tricky. So it goes like this, hands together. Three. Four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Very nice. Okay, let's try a bit quicker. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Very nice. Now we just need to add one last thing. It's the pedal. Every time we're going to hit the F on the left hand, we're going to release the pedal. So we get that nice effect. One last time for this introduction. Let's try with the pedal. One, two, three. Four. Very nice. So now let's see the pre chorus. By the way, we play this pattern on the right hand. We play it eight times before going through the pre-chorus. We are going to add a bass on every one, just like this. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, so the bass notes are F, E flat, D, D flat. Let's practice this. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Once more. One, two, 
three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And for the last time, we won't play the D flat. Okay, now what does the right hand? It goes like this. Three, four. Let's break it down together. We'll play one, two, three, four. A, D, A, A, G, F, G, F. Once again, A, B, A, A, G, F, G, F. Okay, so that's the first time. The second time, we just play B, A, A, G, F, G, F. B, A, A, G, F, G, F. Just like that. So the first time, we play the whole thing like this. A, B, A, A, G, F, G, F. Then we keep the F. And we just play B, A, A, G, F, G, F. And play it one more time. B, A, A, G, F, G, F. And then we'll play B flat, F, F, D flat, A. Like this. One, two, three, four, one. Once again. One, two, three, four, one. Very nice. So let's play the right hand from the top with the counts. It goes like this. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one. Very nice. Now we just have to put hands together. Let's go slowly first. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One. Very nice. Let's go a bit quicker. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one. Very nice. So we play that once, then we play it again like this. So as you can see, we play the same way until we hit the D on the bass. And then we'll play this line in octave. B, A, F, F, B, A, and we'll end on a D minor. Okay, once again together, from here. So we play it once, and the second time we play the ending. One, two, three. Four. Very nice. Alright guys, so that's all for the first part of this tutorial. If you want to see more, please head over to musicgreatness.com. 
as always, thank you for watching and if you liked the video, please leave a like, a comment and subscribe. See you in the next lesson.